Hello, welcome to Awesome Time. This is the show where I tell you about all of the new stuff on VAT19 and stick around, we're doing stupid science. Welcome to episode 122. As always, remember to subscribe to our email newsletter by hitting the card up here. That's how you save money on your next order. It's time for sponsorships and outstanding reviews and recommendations. Yeah. That's kind of a weird yeah, but we'll keep this going. Today is special because it's been a long time since I've had Joey on Awesome Time. So I'm gonna bring him in. Yeah. What's up, what's up? Our new sponsor is GlassesUSA.com. I know yeah. it's impossible to believe that anything with Joey is imperfect. But his eyes are. You wear glasses. I do wear glasses from time to time, yeah. So we have some glasses here oh. that you picked out. I did from glassesusa.com. But you haven't seen these yet. I haven't seen these. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. This is the first pair. So I got the wisdom frames. See how they look. Now I'm wearing my contacts already, so I've got a double prescription going on. <laughs> how do they look, Jamie? Fabulous. Fabulous? Yeah. They look, you they, look good they, with glasses. They feel good. Yeah. They feel good. They're lightweight. Yeah. Their website has, I think, 2,500 different styles to choose from. You got some other ones in here, though. I did get a few. They have a money back guarantee. Okay. And so I wanted to try on a few and see which ones I like the most. Right. And then I can send back the other ones. Free shipping both ways. Nice. And so I get 14 days to decide. Yeah, this is a little more like science professor Joey yeah, than the other one. Me at my desk getting work done. Okay. They have frames from like $48 all the way up to like, you know, designer brands like Ray-Ban and things like that. So yeah, these were not expensive. Now here's pair number three. I feel like this is when you're reading newspaper on your iPad. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, they right. feel good. Yeah, that looks good. That was a great segue into next section, fashion show. Ooh, check out the wide variety of frame shapes on these boys. We won't cut out these men, but cut out the middle men at glassesusa.com and save up to 70% off. Oh, can't see real well? That's okay. We've got you covered with a variety of lens thickness. This fashion show brought to you by GlassesUSA.com. But in all seriousness, you've been wearing glasses for a long time. What did you like the most about GlassesUSA.com? I've actually gotten glasses from other sites, and this one was the most simple, straightforward. They had a lot of good sorting options. I could like sort by square, rectangular frames. Yeah, they just made it super easy. All right. Thanks a lot, Joey. No problem. You know, it just occurred to me that there's somebody else here at VAT19 who could really use GlassesUSA.com's help. Okay, come on in. Hello! It's Chauncey! It is me, it is I, it is Chauncey! I noticed there's a problem with your glasses yeah, I here. Got, I got in a little scuffle with Theodore in the last uh, Confection Perfection, and my glasses got a little broke. Just a little on the side there, you can see it's actually just missing an entire piece. I thought we could use the virtual mirror feature from GlassesUSA.com to help you pick out some New oh, glasses. big brother, yeah, I've heard of this. <laughs> so I've got this computer here, a webcam. If you just like look right in there. Does it gonna steal my soul? <laughs> it might be best for you to take off okay, your glasses. Okay, I'm a little afraid. Okay. <laughs> here we go. Okay. C come a little closer. Okay. <laughs> Okay, oh. let's see what I look like, Jamie. Yeah, we can. I'm excited about this. A new look for old Chauncey. Oh, yeah. This is, oh my goodness, I look so sophisticated. Yeah. There's so many different pairs. They even have sunglasses. Uh-huh. Bifocals. You wear uh -huh. bifocals, don't you? I sometimes wear a monocle. Yeah. Let's, Maybe the Copperfield? The Fonda's fun. Okay. Like a Jane Fonda look. That looks great. Yeah. Cool. Sophisticated and sleek. All right, well, thanks for coming by. Okay, I live here. <laughs> but, but goodbye. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed learning about GlassesUSA.com. Go get yourself a pair. Use the description, the link below for a deal. There's a couple videos from Damien and Dion that you should check out. They had a ton of fun with our Burner Bliss challenge and with our giant soccer ball. So check both those videos out. Okay, I'm excited to get into the new products. I love this one. This is called the Fractal Puzzle. It's probably the most unique jigsaw puzzle I've ever come across. This is birch plywood. It's made in the USA and there's 23 pieces on here 
which might be hard to tell where they start and stop because of the fractal design. I'm gonna try to just get one piece out. <laughs> That's what one of the pieces of this puzzle looks like. Look what happens when you do get a piece in there. It's like it completely disappears. So if you want to challenge yourself to a new kind of jigsaw puzzle, I definitely recommend you check out the Fractal Puzzle, available now, that19.com. Next up is something pretty useful. Throw it in here. This, folks, is the 1G Bungee. You'll never need another bungee cord with the 1G Bungee because they are adjustable in length from six feet to six inches. You can easily change the length of this cord by just pulling it tighter. You get two in a pack. The 1G Bungee is made in the USA. This is really a cool, useful product. Go get yourself a pair of 1G Bungees. Awesome. All right, so, so throw me in the next thing. Oh, okay. This is the bag of unicorn farts. It's filled with unicorn farts, which happen to taste surprisingly similar to cotton candy, if that gives you an idea of what's actually in the bag. It's made in the USA, which is a theme of this episode. Also, 10% of all profits are donated to charities that support children with neurodiversity, which I think is uh, pretty cool and an added bonus. But this is really just like a funny, hilarious gift to give to someone. These unicorn farts are sourced from the most enchanting and gassy unicorns around. Not only do the unicorn farts taste good, they are also this episode's Stupid science. Stupid science. Come on in here, Eric. We gotta... Okay. What's our hypothesis? I believe our hippopotamus is that this bag of unicorn farts taste exactly like real unicorn farts. So that they, is a question that can be tested. Yeah, so first of all, we have to replicate the unicorn. Right. We have to become a unicorn. No problem. I am prepared to do. Now that we have a unicorn, right. I can get out the packaged unicorn farts. Right. And I'll have a taste. Yeah, you taste them, you will be our, the control. I will be the control group. I will have some unicorn farts, and then you will fart into my mouth. Right. So I can taste the unicorn fart and exactly. can compare. Okay. Right. All right. Science. Mm. Oh man. How's it taste? Unicorn farts are quite tasty. Okay. These are the tastiest farts I've ever had. Like hands down. Now I've been eating a lot of lentils today. I don't know if that's gonna affect anything or not, but we'll find out. I'm, re I'm ready to eat your fart. <laughs> <laughs> It's aged poorly. It didn't taste good. I like these unicorn farts better than your unicorn farts. All right. We've proved something here today, haven't we, Jamie? <laughs> I don't know what it is, but we proved it. Yeah. Try your own experiment at home and tell us, did your unicorn farts taste like these? Let, us, the let us know in the comments. Yeah. Now hold on. I'll fart out of here. <laughs> All right. Send me in that creepy brain. This, my friends, it's the brain candle. Check that out. That's amazing. This whole thing is a candle, so it's a hard wax brain inside of there, surrounded by gel wax, and it's a real candle. Burn this thing down. Just like real brain, it's unscented. At least I think brain is unscented. It's got about 20 hour burn time, and it is also made in the USA. I think this thing is just lovely. It seems kind of ironic that we have a brain product right after stupid science. It actually uses a brain, which is new for us. <laughs> All right, that's the brain candle. Buy yours now. All right, send me that half-opened product. This, my friends, is a brew candy. It is beer-flavored hard candy. That's the honey ale. That's the hoppy IPA. And that's the Roasty Stout. So the bag has a mix of all of these different beer-inspired hard candies. You know, once it gets cooked and made, all the alcohol is gone, but the flavor from that particular beer is still in there. And they are darn good. I really like these. And they too are made in the USA. So pick yourself up a pack of brew candy. I think you'll love them, just like I do. That was cheesy. All right, it's time for fan art.
Wow, that was an amazing collection of fan art as always. Here is the address if you want to send in some of your own work and see it in a future episode of Awesome Time. We'd love to see it. I think it's uh, about time to wrap this episode up. Remember, follow us on social media. That's Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. We do weekly giveaways every Friday, so there's no reason not to follow us. All right, let's wrap this thing up. As always, check out the videos around me. There's some really cool ones, I promise you. Check out GlassesUSA.com as well. And as always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bat19.com